and welcome back to the channel. On this video, I want to talk about something that's kind of a pet peeve for me, and I've done a video once before on this talking about it, but I want to bring it up again. It was quite a while ago that I talked about this, but something that kind of, I'm not sure why people do this, but um, riding either your e-bike or bicycle or e-scooter or whichever uh, the wrong way in the bike lane, the wrong direction. So I'm going to come out here right now to the bike lane and show you. So the arrow you can see right there, the arrow is pointing to go this direction, right? And I'm going to hold the camera down so you can get a look at it there. So my question is, my question is why Do some people ride against traffic on the bike lane coming forward toward you and let me know what you think in the comments of that and does it bother you like it bothers me? I think it's a dangerous situation and I'm not sure why people do that. Um, and have you ever had that happen? And if you have, leave a comment in the comments below whether you've had that happen to you before or how do you feel about that? Um, bikes, scooters, or people even walking in the bike lane. I've had that before where they're walking toward you uh, in the bike lane. I mean, it's supposed to be designated for us and the arrows, as you can see right here again, clearly say to go in this direction. So I don't know why people do it, but they continue to do it. Not all the time. I don't see it all the time. Majority of people don't do that, but there are some that do. And um, I don't know if it's only me it bothers, but um, let me know in the comments if it bothers you. Um, that's one thing. I mean, there's not a lot of things that people do that are crazy, but I think that's one. And, I mean, now that we're on the topic of things that people do that's crazy, another thing, although I haven't seen it um, around me, I haven't seen this, but I've seen video where there, this is happening, but uh, riding your e-bike, like I'm talking about uh, with traffic, around no, not that there's nobody around there's traffic around and riding your e-bike and doing wheelies i mean that's i know it might be fun for some people to be doing wheelies but i don't think you should be doing them on the street with traffic around or anybody around if you want to do the wheelies i think you should be doing it uh away from traffic um I mean, that's my opinion on the uh, wheelie thing. I'm gonna turn around and go back this way. But uh, what do you think about that? What do you think about people doing wheelies uh, uh, with traffic on the, uh, on the street? Anyway, uh, the wheelie one doesn't bother me so much because I don't see it very much here, but if I did see it, I, it would probably bother me even more. But I don't really see it here, but that would really uh, bother me just for the fact that I think it's uh, dangerous and plus it, I think it, that kind of stuff will ruin it for others 
down the line, if, if the law, you know, if they crack down on things, that's one of the things they'll look at and say, hey, you know, people riding recklessly on their bikes. Because I think that's what that is. Maybe I'm in the minority, but that's my opinion. And uh, like I say, let me know what you think in the comments. And then the other one that really bugs me, though, is the uh, riding the wrong way in the bike lanes or walking in the wrong way or in the bike lane. Like, I mean, it's not like walking on the sidewalk. Sounds like I'm all roweled up. I'm not, I'm not really roweled up, but it just, I don't know, I just thought about it today, about occasionally when you see people doing that. Um, I think it's, it's irritating and I think dangerous too, like the riding in the wrong direction. The only time I would ever, I would maybe do it if I was only going a very short distance and I could look down there and see that there's nobody around. Um, just because if there's three lanes of traffic each way and I'm only going one, uh, I'm only going up one street maybe and uh, and there's nobody around and I can clearly see there's nobody around and I'd maybe, uh, scoot down there quick that way but that'd be the only thing and that would be so rare um, that it would have to be a certain circumstance and um, and like I say it would be like a, a one-off kind of thing you wouldn't it's not something I would make a habit of if I was in a situation where I had to but these people look like they're just you know just doing it deliberately like they don't I don't know if they just don't care or they don't understand that you're supposed to go with traffic or what. Anyway, it kind of sounds like I am and maybe I am venting a little bit. But... And if it's not that, what bugs you about other riders? What gets under your skin about other, uh, that other riders do? Like I'm talking, not only uh, e-bikes, but I'm talking cyclists in general too, going the wrong way. But like I said, the majority of people are good. It's just the odd one though, once in a while. And it makes you uh, shake your head. But what irritates you? Like, is there anything that bugs you about other uh, riders, whether it's e-bikes, bicycles, or maybe it's even motors, stuff that motors do. I mean, I've got some things too that they do as well. One one thing I don't like that motorists do once in a while is honk your honk their horn at you when you're not even doing anything. You're not in their way. I think they're just honking to say, "Hey, buddy, get off of our street," thinking you know, like it's their street only, and they they don't want to share the road. I think that's what you get. Some people like that. But the honking of the horn is kind of like, you're not expecting it, so uh, when they get up really close and do that, it can be dangerous too, because you're not expecting it. It can scare the bejeebers out of you and have you uh, possibly uh, lose control of your bike, you know, because you're not expecting it and it scares, it scares you. Another beautiful day here in the state of Oregon. We're getting toward the later stages now already of uh, summer. Hard to believe. 
fall will be knocking on the door before long. And that's going to do it for another video here on the channel. If you like this video, hit that like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and thank you very much for doing that. And if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit that notification bell and you'll be notified. And if you want to leave a comment on this or any other video, go ahead and leave that in the comments below. Once again, thank you for joining me for this video. And until next time.